so fleet bank is viridian bank now huh anyway recently a new feature has been added to rise you can now salvage uh, commodities at o4 site you remember o4 how we went to go sightseeing around there yeah that o4 so today i'm gonna go there and i'm gonna try to salvage something like maybe level up my salvage uh, skill a little bit maybe get some money out of that i have been there before already i flew there with e11 and i took some leftover commodities from there and i sold them and that was nice but uh, i don't want to bother with e11 today and i don't want to bother with six pods so i'm just going to take an a4 instead so let's go get ourselves an a4 Six three eight three three. That's a different one. Let me write that down. Six three eight three three. Okay, where is it? Uh, doom, 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 doom. Eight three five. Eight three three. We are gonna need a pod, so let's get ourselves a pod. All oh, right, of course, I forgot about that. Okay, which one is that? Eight, four, six. Uh, yeah, okay, 846. So yeah, I'm just gonna fly to 04 now. You have seen that flight before, so I'm go not gonna record all of it. Kinda sucks that it is night, so landing will be probably slightly annoying, because I don't think there are any lights at 04 side, but I guess we'll see when we get there. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I think everything should be fine, right? Let's reset the trim. Yeah, the pod is uh, loaded. Yep. The hell is that over there? Looks weird. Well, anyway, let's just try to take off. Is my joystick working? Yeah, I guess so. IBR six three eight three three. Theo at departure. Go ahead. I V R six three eight three three. I S R N A K O E W A. Three West and North West. A tree tree. You are cleared for dust off. Heading to eight zero. Radar vectors lofty. I should have set up the auto flight earlier, but that's okay. That's fine. That's no problem whatsoever. Okay, 280. Hopefully this is not gonna make me crash into a building. Okay, I haven't flown A4 in a while, so I'm not feeling very confident, but hopefully I can make it. Way to zero. Yeah, it does kind of put me into a building, but that's okay. We can move around. Okay, 
Okay, okay, okay. Just a bit more to the right. Now can enable auto flight. Yeah, so we didn't crash upon taking off, so that's good. So yeah, I'm just gonna stop the recording now because it's just gonna be flying and you have seen all that multiple times. So yeah, I'm gonna resume the recording when we get closer to 04 side. Okay, so we're about 20 kilometers away from 04. And turns out there is a car parked right at the waypoint, it seems. So hopefully I'm not gonna crash into that. We still need to get lower to get out of the clouds. So we can see something at least. Radar altimeter isn't giving me... AGL, so that's a bit concerning. I don't remember how much below the sea level this place is. Okay, now I can see it. All right. We need to be below one kilometer in order to get out of the clouds. Also, an interesting thing happened while I was leaving this. Apparently, Rana was coming back from Easy Dock. Yeah, I need to be lower. Landing lights are already activated. Okay, we're below one kilometer. We are out of the clouds, but everything is freaking dark and I cannot see shit. I think it's time to fly by hand. So yeah, Rana was coming back and I got a traffic warning and I got a little a little bit spooked. Okay, thank you Lightning. Now I can have a feel for how far away the ground is, which is just perfect. We're still 7 kilometers away. Yeah, it's kind of really annoying to to land here in the dark. Don't recommend. Terrain, terrain. I'm aware of terrain, thank you very much. Why? Okay. Pull up. Okay, I can see it. Okay, 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 good. Let's turn just a little bit away from the waypoint so we don't crash into the fucking car. This is scary. This is seriously scary. Okay, let's start landing. Cut the engines. Oh, there it is. There's the O4 itself. Let's get a bit closer to it so we can at least look at something while we are doing our salvaging. Yeah, gear is down. Well, struts. Can I see it? No, we're still too far away from it. Okay. 
we're not going to crash into the cars, so that's good. Oh, there it is. soft enough I guess and we cannot see it very well anyway <laughs> well there it is you know that it is there so whatever okay nice we we didn't die now if we don't die on the way back as well that would be great and I think I still haven't finished talking about it so yeah run was coming to Langen days and I got a traffic warning like my a4 computer voice lady just going like traffic 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 and like what the fuck but it wasn't that dangerous because the closest he's been to me was 14 kilometers i think or something like that so there wasn't really much uh, a collision probability and i guess he was just doing contracts he delivered like 120 passengers from easy dog got paid a bunch of money i want to do that too at some point but um, it's a bit intimidating to go to easy dog in real life so i think i'm gonna need more simulator practice before i try okay let's see first of all i'm curious about inventory management because it wasn't working last time i was here so let's see what do they have here pictures binoculars sunglasses 20 six sunglasses imagine salvaging sunglasses from a crashed space station just space station fucking full of sunglasses or something first aid kit night vision colony uplink well, like those are useful what is the last cigarettes yeah i don't think you can do anything with cigarettes or first aid kit or Polaroid pictures. Yeah, it is a uh, year. What? Uh, I think it's like 250 years into the future or something like that. I forgot. Oh, wait. Let's actually check. It, it may be. It may say the date in the news on Discord. No, it doesn't. It might say the date on the news website. I keep forgetting how far into the future this is. No, it doesn't freaking say that. Well, it's like something 250 years in the future. Whatever. Approximately. Not quite, but something like that. I keep forgetting. And so, so far in the future, we still have fucking Polaroid pictures. And manual transmissions in cars. <laughs> Well, okay, so these are the kind of items you can get, I suppose, from the salvage. Well, nothing too amazing, I suppose. Apart from colony uplink. But then again, I'm not planning on building any colonies. So, so let's go into cargo operations. This is how much stuff is left over from previous salvage attempts made by Rana, I suppose. And as you can see, there's like a metric factor of common. And I think this is going to be a bit of a problem. Because you kind of want to sell which expensive stuff, right? Like rare or consumer goods. But you more often than not probably get common materials. And it's just going to keep piling up here because nobody is going to freaking move it anywhere. Because it's just not worth it. <laughs> and it's probably just going to keep piling up here forever gonna have some ridiculous amount of common materials just lying around and that's gonna be a bit awkward so let's see you just press salvage and you have to wait for one minute and then wait you don't have to wait for one minute how interesting so we just found 4mt of something and it tells you how much you uh, how much price you you can get for your salvage but it doesn't actually tell you what you have salvaged so that's kind of not very convenient 
Yeah, I guess that was common. Well, it was cheap, right? So let's see. It's supposed to take a minute, but I guess it takes less than a minute now. Maybe it's a glitch or something. Yeah, looks like it's the, now it's going to take a proper minute to salvage. I wonder why that first one was so quick. So let's just wait here. I'm kind of planning to sit here and to salvage, try to salvage stuff for a little while. Oh, that's, that's more expensive. I'm guessing this could be like fabricated maybe or something. I wish it just straight up told you what you salvaged instead of the price and it's not even the real price it's like global market price and uh, for how much you can sell it, it depends on where you're going to sell it well anyway as you can see it's nothing too exciting but it's just free commodities that you can get f for free essential and you can sell them and you can make some money so that's nice so I'm just gonna be sitting here and I'll see if I can salvage uh, more rare or more consumer goods i don't think i'm gonna do it like too much like maybe like half an hour like maybe 20 minutes whatever for how much i have patience basically and then i'm gonna load up the good stuff and uh, bring it back to Deus and sell it but for now i'm gonna pause the recording Okay, so I've been sitting here for like 40 minutes and watching YouTube and I haven't been keeping track of all the stuff I've been salvaging, but I think most of it was common. So let's see if we actually got anything good out of all that. Probably not. Okay, let's see. Oh, we actually got some stuff. I, I had it actually written down. So we got like, is it nine? Yeah, it's nine. So we got four rare. We got two consumer and we got like 21 fabricated. These are the ones I've been keeping track of, so that's kind of nice. So it wasn't like completely useless. I, I thought it would be a complete waste of time, but yeah, <laughs> 600 MT of common. It was 400 before. So yeah, common is just going to keep piling up. But uh, let's actually try to decide what we want uh what was the website was this the website yeah let's see buying a rare and consumer this is what we need to look at so nine rare would give us like 7200 and three consumer would give us less than that so i'm gonna load up rare okay it's not really that much profit but now my skill is higher and the next time i do this hopefully i can get more more stuff so let's grab rare uh, load containers and you cannot mix stuff by the way so we loaded 9 MT of rare into our cargo container and there is still 8 MT of free space but we cannot put anything else in there unfortunately um, yeah that's just how it is so we got our stuff now I'm just gonna take off and fly back to Deus and sell all this stuff so let's set a waypoint uh, let's actually I kind of want to see that that little car that was there okay let me get my joystick back in place because I moved it away I'm gonna Take a moment. There we go. Alrighty then. Mm. 
Okay. No, oh, goddamn. My wires need adjustment again. Okay, that's better. That's better. Okay, so let's go have a look at that car. Carefully. There it is. There's that car. Mystery car in the middle of nowhere. So yeah, more throttle. Okay, I think we are flying. Uh, let's reset trim by the way. Okay, okay, okay. Now, back to our waypoint. God damn it. There we go. So now I'm just gonna fly back to Deus. And landing at Deus is gonna be way easier with the ATC and lights and, well, everything. So that's good. Okay, so yeah, let me just get my shit together there we go let's switch to nav pitch I guess auto flight yeah it's gonna take a while to get back and obviously I'm not gonna record that so see you in a moment So we're coming in for landing, hopefully. I'm gonna try to land at the airport apron. Forgot to acknowledge. We should be going to D-pads, I think. We are not quite going there, but they did say 060, right? Unless I didn't hear it right. Well, if they want to correct us, they, they are going to do that, so whatever. Can't see anything anywhere yet. Oh well. Oh, there we go. There is something. Yeah, okay, okay. So 
care to tell me to land maybe would be much appreciated okay good I don't quite see it though, but well, hopefully we'll be able to see it. I think there is still some trouble with the lighting on those landing pads. But oh well, such is life, I suppose. I think I will be able to see it well enough. Well, I can kind of already see them, yeah. That must have been just some minor glitch. Okay. It's been a bit laggy. That should be okay. A tree tree. Change to advisory frequency approved. Stop, stop, stop. No, 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 don't stop, worry about stop, it. Stop, don't stop, worry about it. Don't worry about it. 50, 40, 30, 20, 10. Here we are at the airfield. All is well. Now we can we can we can sell our stuff, which is not going to be very expensive, but oh well, not much profit. I mean, uh, we are carrying the rare, right? Yeah. Sell everything. Wasn't that? I think I calculated more than that. I probably just looked at the wrong price or something like that. I don't know. Uh, now we need to refuel. Yeah. Well, we made more money than we spent on renting the aircraft, so that's good. Okay, now, as you may notice, I haven't been bothering with the truck this time. So now we're gonna bring this back to Rusty's. And uh, I think I figured out how to do that without ATC being a problem. You just tell them you want to take off, and then you just fly low enough, and they don't really care much. They don't even shout at you for not following their directions. So let's see if we can do that again this time. Naturally, we're not going to 270. 
we are going somewhere completely different, which is Rusty's Rentals. I'm not hitting anything, am I? No, I'm not hitting anything. I went a little bit over 100, but I guess they didn't see me anyway, so that's good. I mean, they are not shouting at me, so that's like the only thing that matters, right? it a little bit oh well anyway yeah. hopefully ATC is happy with us hopefully let's unload our pod 846 yeah Joystick go away and the boop and the boop. Uh, let's see how poor of a landing we made. Oh, yeah, that's our flying pod over there. I got a bit confused for a second. Oh, it's actually not too bad looking from this side. But from this side, yeah, kind of off-center. Oh well. Maybe one day. Okay, let's give all the stuff back to Rusty. Uh, the first one was pods, uh, 8 for 6, right? And the other one is this uh, A4, which was 63833, yes. That was a bit scary. Well, anyway, that was a success. Um, we haven't really made much money. Actually, considering the time we spent doing all this, it was extremely inefficient. <laughs> and, I'd, and I'd do better just flying to Kansas and back, uh, maybe even to Alphaville and back. But whatever, it's something new. It's good to have new stuff in the game and you don't need any uh, starting money to like start uh, getting shit from 04. So that's good for new players, I suppose. Uh, this is really confusing. Why is this symbol here? I don't think it was there before. It seems to be there on all vehicles and all MFDs. Well, on that page of MFD, I mean. Well, anyway, this is going to be it for this video. Yeah. Next time, hopefully, we're going to be going up to Easy Dock, but uh, I'm not sure when that is going to happen. As I said, I need to practice. And I'm just finding less and less time to play this game recently. This is just how it is. Well, anyway, that's it for now. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.